On a rainy day in mid-September, the Manchester Energy Committee and Green Mountain Power hosted an event in the Rec Park, inviting Greenworks, an electric motor company, to show off their wares. So I'm Terry Robison representing Greenworks, and basically what we have is an Optimus battery mower. So this machine can mow for eight hours or 24 acres on a charge, and we can charge it in under three hours with an optional supercharger. So the commercial landscaper can basically go out and mow all day now. The only maintenance is you grease the front wheel spindles every 50 hours. You have no air filter, fuel filter, oil filter. There's no belts normally associated with a deck. There's no pulleys, there's no springs, there's no transmission, there's no drive system. We're actually driving the machine off of a hub wheel motor. So that literally is the transmission of the machine is in the rear wheels. Well, the select board created uh, an energy committee. It's an official town committee. And our mandate is to save the town money by spending less on energy. And also, the other mandates are to help promote renewable energy within the state, you know, solar, wind, geothermal, and to reduce greenhouse gas emissions. We're sponsoring events like this to try to get people to switch to electric lawnmowers and all the other power tools. These electric machines, like leaf blowers and uh, lawnmowers, they use so much less, uh, they have no fossil fuel, the pollution and the emissions is like zero compared to a very, very, very high rate of pollution, especially from things like leaf blowers and weed whackers. Greenworks also offers other tools. We have walk-behind mowers, we have string trimmers, we have backpack blowers, we have handheld blowers, we have chainsaws, we have cutoff saws, we have 70 tools in our lineup. So basically Greenworks says we have a full trailer solution for a landscaper. And the owner of Greenworks is always saying he doesn't want anyone to try one of our hand tools or get on one of our mowers and say it's great but it's not as good as gas. We always want to be better than that. So our blade speed is actually faster than a gasoline machine. Our cut quality can actually be better than a gasoline machine. So you're not giving up anything by going to battery. There's also rebates available in Vermont. Um, if you buy the machine in your commercial landscapers, there's significant rebates available from your power company as well. Um, and that helps take um, the differential between the cost of the battery machine being more than a gasoline mower. No different than what's going on in the car industry with the subsidies on paying for the difference between having a higher priced machine going battery. The website moelectric.org features different spreadsheets to help you calculate the economic and environmental impact of switching your lawn equipment to electric. And the local power companies, including Green Mountain Power, offer significant rebates if you choose to lessen your carbon emissions and make the switch. For the GNAT TV News Project, I'm Bert Grinstead.